Hey everybody, it's Ben here and I'm starting work on a new project. Uh, what you see in front of you is the beginning of my do-it-yourself plug-in hybrid uh, diesel electric pickup truck project. Right now I'm just calling it the super truck because I can't think of a better name. Uh, if you come up with one, please tell me. But basically in this project, um, I've already built an electric motorcycle, an electric car, I hybridized the car, and I've helped a lot of other people with their projects. So on this one, the idea is to take all that knowledge, put it together to build a vehicle that's gonna get fantastic fuel economy, but it's also going to be able to haul firewood, tow a trailer, and do all the other things that a truck can do. So here I've got a diesel engine. This is a 2.4 liter, and it came out of an old Mercedes car. Uh, that was a, a 1981 240D. These engines are well known to be very reliable. Uh, they're, they're very simple. It's not all computer controlled. It's, it's mechanical, so it's very straightforward. Uh, they're also well known to be used for conversions for uh, biodiesel and vegetable oil systems. Right behind that is a stock five-speed manual transmission from a Chevy S10. Uh, this just came out of the truck that uh, I'm going to convert. Uh, what we might end up doing though is using a transmission from a four-wheel drive S10 and not really for using any of the, the four-wheel drive components, the, the transfer case or anything, but that's a little bit shorter transmission and it's going to have a nice large area that we'll be able to uh, connect the electric motor to. So here's some of the magic. It's a manual transmission and I've got here an 11 inch electric series wound forklift motor. That's going to connect to the drive shaft and it's going to do it after the transmission. So when the transmission's in neutral, I'll be able to drive the truck on just the electric motor and I won't even need the engine to be on. So it's going to be a parallel hybrid, but the driver will have control over what, whether they want to use the engine running on biofuels or the electric motor running on electricity from the batteries or both. Uh, the only downside I've heard to engines like this is they don't have great acceleration for the car. But if you have an electric turbocharger built right in, so what? So this is just the start of my project. I just wanted to tell you about it and uh, get the ball rolling. I know this project's gonna take a while. It's gonna need a lot of collaboration. We're gonna need some input for um, modifying the open source motor controller for running the motor and doing a hybrid system instead of an electric car system. Uh, I'm also hoping to be able to use an open source battery charger and BMS. Uh, but there's the idea. I hope you like it and look forward to updates in the future.